Hoopla Kid shows. Loss of power! Come on, let's find out what Gordon and his friends are up to today! Good morning, everybody! Gordon, good, good morning, morning to you! Hop on, everybody! Beep, beep! <laughs> <laughs> okay, let's go! Come on! I'm gonna sit here! I'm so excited! Are you all ready to get going now? We're, We're ready, Gordon! Go, go, bus Gordon! Off on a safe trip! Beep, beep! Oh, Pandy, your flashlight is so bright. I got this from my mom for my birthday. When you press this button, it shines so bright and pretty. Whoa. Uh-oh, road maintenance ahead. It might be a little bumpy. Sit tight, okay, children? Beep, beep. Huh? The battery fell out of your flashlight. Huh? My flashlight. Huh? What? No, why? <laughs> My flashlight is broken now. <laughs> Candy, let me see the flashlight. I'm pretty sure that I can make it work again. Huh? You can really? Look, this is a secret weapon. <laughs> Thanks a lot, Toby. The battery wasn't in very tight. <laughs> <laughs> Miss Sandy, how does a little battery make a flashlight work anyway? Well, we'll do an experiment with electricity in school today. And then you can learn all about how it works. I want you all to participate. Gordon will be the teaching assistant, okay? <laughs> wow, that sounds great! We're at the kindergarten. Gogo Bus Gordon has arrived safely. Beep beep. Okay, kids, time to get off the bus. Yes, yes, yes Sandy. Yeah, we're here. <laughs> we're here. No need to rush. Let's have some fun today. Children, I'll see you in class later. <laughs> All right, teaching assistant Gordon. Welcome to the Little Electricity Museum, children. Wow! Now, everyone, electricity is a kind of energy we use. It powers our lights and appliances. It's very useful, but something we should always be careful with. Children, let's have a think. What are the things powered by electricity? Do you know? <laughs> Computers, which are in fact my favorite things to learn on. The AC, it keeps the air cool. The vacuum, my mom needs that every day to clean up with. And the refrigerator too, it keeps the yummy cakes from going bad. <laughs> <laughs> That's right, you are all very clever. How about we go test out some devices around us and see how electricity is generated? Baby, yeah, yeah, let's, let's go. go. Watch this! Wow! wow the light, light really lit up. up! I made electricity with heat? Yes, it's thermoelectric. When electrons move from the hot end to the cold end, it makes electricity. Look, Kyle. This one's supposed to be powered by the wind. Go, go Team Dino! Wind, wind blow! <gasps> Do you know, devices 
that are powered by the wind <clears throat> are more environmentally friendly and sustainable devices. Wow, so wind can make power too. That's really amazing. Wow. wow. Electricity can be generated by a treadmill. The faster you run, the more it makes. We can make electricity by running? Let me try that. I'm Electricity Boy! <laughs> wow! The light bulb is getting really bright! <laughs> I can go even faster! <laughs> oh no! Handy! Not so fast! You're making too much! The light bulb can't handle it! I, I broke all the lights! Oh, uh-oh. I cut through the power cable while digging up the road. Now there's a power outage all along the whole street. I better call the power company to come by and fix it. It's so dark. I'm scared. I'm sorry. I didn't mean to do that. It's so scary. I, I want to go home now. Wait, I just remembered I have a light. Hey, everyone, I have a flashlight. Scary face! <laughs> Gordon, turn on your headlights. Sure, no problem. Beep beep! Huh? There's a light now? It's Gordon! <sighs> Gordon, I have an idea. Pandy, can I borrow your flashlight, please? Of course you can! Okay, kids, time to play a little game together. <laughs> what does this look like? Wow, a butterfly! I know how to do that, too! <laughs> <laughs> I can do a peacock. And I can do a rabbit. Check it out! Wow. See? Amazing! Gordon? See if you can figure out what's causing this power outage, okay? You got it! Go Go Bus Gordon will solve the case! Beep beep! Bodywork color ready! Nano transformation ready! Go Go Bus Gordon transform! Check the electrical circuits. I should choose a fire engine. Go, go, bus, transform. Fire Chief Gordon. Now Fire Chief Gordon can start checking things out. Time to activate the Smart Analyzer so I can detect the cause of the power outage. There's no problem with the circuit in the school building. It's from the construction spot we passed. So that's it. Now I know the cause. We've got to fix this cable quickly and restore the power. We won't be able to pull the cable out. We're going to need to bring in a crane to lift it up out of there. Beep beep! Hey, look, it's Gordon. Great. With Gordon helping us, we'll get this fixed up a lot faster. Go, go, bus Gordon will solve the problem. Beep beep! Gordon, the damaged cable is very heavy. Can you help us? No problem. All right, that should have it fixed. Thanks a lot for your help, Gordon. You're welcome. Well, now that the cable's repaired, I've got to get back. Beep beep. I'm a big tiger, roar. I'm a big dinosaur. I am a little peacock, roar. roar. Uh -huh. 
Where'd all the shadows go? Well now, looks like Gordon fixed the power. It's Fire Chief Gordon! Wow! Wow! <laughs> Problem solved! The power's back on! Beep beep! But I was going to make a shadow parrot before the lights came back on. Children, let's move on to a new game. What do you think? But shadow puppets are the most fun thing to play, right? Although most electricity can be quite dangerous, there's one kind that isn't. And it's something we come into contact huh? with a lot. And that kind is static. Static electricity is made by friction. Rub plastic against something dry, like your hair or clothes, to generate static electricity. We're using this ruler. Now with the ruler, place it near something light to pick it up. A balloon or paper bits will work well. Come children, let's try to make some static electricity. Okay! Wow! <laughs> <laughs> Keeping all you guys happy is my main mission, beep beep! Hey, hey! Now kids, while it's true that electricity makes our lives much more convenient, it's also very dangerous. In that case, Miss Sandy, how should we stay safe when using electricity? Things made of metal are electrically conductive, so never touch a power socket with metal objects or your hands. Don't get electrical appliances wet, and stay away from cables, if they look worn. Don't play near an electrical box either, because there could be danger of a short circuit or a leakage. I see! To stay safe, be careful with electricity! Beep beep! That's all for today, children! Goodbye, everyone! Shows. <laughs>